what's up? I'm Brian here doing another video for you guys and this time we're gonna be talking about another shadow glass figure that just came out of nowhere. I shouldn't be surprised because half of these just suddenly showed up, but this is the Transformers Generation Shattered Glass Commander Class Jetfire. Now, if you could get your hands on a Jetfire mold, whether it's this or the original, go ahead and get it because I think it's one of the best molds to come out of War for Cybertron. In fact, it's probably the best top two for the Siege line. The only competition is Omega Supreme. I really love that thing, but Jetfire, I mean, it just blows me away. And it's everything that I wanted out of Jetfire, too. But, uh, man, the recolor is good. So this is based on the Toy Hobby exclusive recolor, which they use for the Shattered Glass lineup. And I think that's perfect because it, it's stunning, it's evil. I mean, yes, you can change Jetfire to an evil Decepticon, but this is an evil Autobot color scheme. And I think it really works with the black, purple. I think the light green is a nice touch. And also, take a look at the flare effects. They're in blue, which is funny because the arc set also comes with the same mold of flare effects. And they're also in blue. So, I thought that was kind of funny. But, uh, yeah, the jet mode just looks amazing, stunning. I love it. Taking a look at the robot mode. The only thing I'll say about the robot mode is I wish there was a little bit more green because all you have it is in the cockpit. I wish there was a little more going up to the chest, especially since the chest is just mostly black. I kind of feel like it's missing something, but I think overall it does look nice. I love the purple on the backpack, the silver on the wings, the purple on the side of the arms, that looks nice. And um, yeah, I mean, I have no complaints about this. Taking a look at the full suit mode. So you have the chest and then you also have the helmet. Again, it looks really nice. The silver face mask does look a little wide for the head, but uh, otherwise, I, I think that's just how it's painted. It does look really good. Now, I've talked about Pulse exclusives. I don't like Pulse exclusives. I feel like they should be more rounded off. Uh, in Canada, it's not really that uh, good, but uh, I, I've talked about that to death, so I'm not going to bring it up too much here. But I really wish this wasn't just a Pulse exclusive, maybe something for EB Games or something like that. I don't know. But uh, this Jetfire does look amazing, and it's also got the biggest box for the Shattered Glass lineup because it's the only Commander Class figure. So, with that way, what do you guys think? I think this looks amazing. Please comment below. Like, uh, bleh, bleh. <laughs> Let me know. I'm sorry I messed up there. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe, all those fun dudettes, and I will see you guys next time.